Welcome back to my channel guys. I am Nicole if you're new here. I have just got back from doing my Aldi grocery haul. I bought a little bit more than I planned on buying. My freezers are pretty chockers at the moment so I had to be pretty careful with what I bought freezer wise. Um, but yeah, pretty happy with like fresh produce sort of part of it. That was the main thing I was going for. But I'll show you what I've got going and I've got to do the cold things first as usual because the fire's on, it's a bit cold today and I'm a little bit sick so keeping the house nice and warm. I've got my young bloke home cook as well. But i got some frozen beans, we've got some wedges. I did notice that this pack is smaller, 750 grams. I don't know whether it was all 750 grams. I don't feel like it was all 750 but $1.99, um, they're pretty good wedges. I've got some salmon portion skin on. I've got a garlic bread. I've got one of the older boys coming over tonight. It was hubby's birthday yesterday. So I'm doing big pizzas and garlic bread. And we're going to have cake. We didn't end up doing it last night because hubby was so full from the massive dinner I made him. I've um, got some bacon. That'll be for pizzas and just probably breakfast over the weekend. I got some chicken breast. I bought one of these that I haven't seen before. Super saver, scotch fillet portion. So I'd probably get about, I don't know, four or five steaks out of that, I suppose, for 25 bucks. It's not too bad. I uh, got a value pack of the ham, which is good. Just chop those little bits and you can chuck a couple in the freezer or pop them all in the fridge. Depends how fast you use them. I got some more vanilla yogurt. That'd be nice with the fruit that I bought. Um, what else we got? I bought a block of aged cheddar. This is actually going to be to take to barley. And I bought these vintage slices. These are the same. I'm actually gonna chop one slice into four and I'm gonna put it with some crackers to take on the plane when we go. So I thought I'd pop those away. I've got some mozzarella for the pizzas. I bought some uh, dips, so I've got the capsicum roasted cashews and just the hummus one as well. I think that's about it for my cold stuff. I bought two dozen eggs, I bought some salsa, bought some pineapple for the pizzas I'm going to make, some more diced tomatoes, I've got one loaf of bread. My young bloke really, really does not like grain bread at all. Like, I made him eggs on two eggs on one toast this morning and he just he didn't even eat it so i thought stuff that's not gonna eat it i bet i'll just buy him what he's gonna eat i uh, got some microwave popcorn got a box of couscous i've got some grape tomatoes these are like three bucks a pound at the moment i'd like them to be a bit cheaper won't be long and they will be with the warmer weather i got two bunches of bananas I got some Swiss brown mushrooms and some more sliced mushrooms. I actually bought a pun of these yesterday that cost me six fifty or more worse and I got these for four ninety nine at Aldi. So quite a big price difference. I'm actually going to make my arancini. Um, one of you requested the recipe for that, so I will do that for you tomorrow. Um, actually I'll probably cook the rice today, but I'll show you. Yeah, I'll show you when I make it. It's really, really absolutely beautiful. Uh, I got some Vegemite, I actually looked at the price of the same one at Woolworths and this was 50 cents cheaper so I thought alright, that's okay, we've, have, we've been running out for a little bit. Aldi had their strawberries for $1.99 a punnet so I was super happy to see the price of those, got four of them. And that's also why I got so many bananas because I thought oh, I love strawberries and bananas chopped up together. I actually had some for morning tea with some yogurt, it was really good. Got some Lebanese cucumbers, normal um continental ones are about three bucks at the moment it's just ridiculous i've got some brussels sprouts i've got some trust tomatoes these were about 550 for the half a kilo so it's not too bad i was actually hoping they would have some basil so i was really thinking i was going to make some bruschetta or something like that but they didn't have any uh, i got some broccoli i bought some sour cream and i've got about three kilos of the stuff in the fridge so that was a bit of a long moment but oh well uh, i got some spaghetti haven't got any of that at the moment and i did a spaghetti bog the other night and i've got two meals left over frozen in the freezer so we can have that one night i've got some english muffins hubby loves those for brekkie got some more of these muesli bars 
some water crackers. I actually got these for the aeroplane. These are just cracked pepper ones and they're just original. So we'll probably just take, I don't know, we probably won't use all of them, but yeah. We've got the dips there, so we'll use some for the dips. And um, yeah, I'll probably put that one away for the aeroplane. I bought some sesame snacks. I love these things. They're really good. There's like 52 calories in one pack and 0 0.4 saturated fat. And there's like four in a pack. They are just my favorite thing at the moment. I've uh, got some nachos, um, what do you call them, like CC's, triangle chips, corn chips. <laughs> um, I grabbed four packets with one of those mints that I've got frozen. I was thinking I might do nachos one night. Um, I grabbed four packets because one of my older boys got Uber Eats or whatever it is to get a order for him um, yesterday and they didn't have the chips, so he's got the salsa and that's it. I've uh, got some chips, salt and vinegar, and some sour cream and onion. I've got two cartons of skim milk. I've got the doggos, some dentist sticks. Um, I only buy them if they're about 12 bucks, so worth 13 for 28, which is pretty good. And what else? We've got some cashews. I'm putting them away for barley as well. And I've got a bag of salad mix here. I've also got panko breadcrumbs there for the arancini I'm going to make. I bought some rice cracker snacks for myself. Um, my daughter actually likes those too, so she can probably take some of those for school. I've got some chickpeas. I've got some chicken stock for chicken stock cubes for, well, just for using, but I needed some to make the arancini. I've got two beef stroganoff mixes. I've um, got some beef in the freezer, and that's why I bought another thing of mushrooms as well. Um, some dishcloths. I bought some more of these dishwasher cleaners. They were, yeah, four bucks, like I said in my vlog the other day, pretty cheap. And some dishwashing tablets. I bought some Arborio rice, a couple of tomato paste for the pizzas, and some apple and raspberry, which is just the good one, not the no sugar free one that I bought for my husband, and he was pretty sad. <laughs> so all this cost me $94. So quite expensive. Like I said, I normally spend about 160 But the new goggles. I've got some new ones and I've got the um bit where I don't know, bifocals. Yeah. And I needed to get bigger ones because I needed that bit to be bigger. So yeah, they're really comfy and I like them. Um but yeah, I've still got to go down to Coles. There's a few things I've got in my basket on my app on my phone that I really, really want to get. So I'm gonna um I don't know, I'm gonna put the veggies away and have something to eat. It's twelve thirty, I'm pretty hungry. So I have something to eat and then I'll pop down to Coles and finish off my last bit of shopping. So I'm just in my pantry grabbing the dressing, so a makeup dressing and then I've got these little containers that's half oil and uh, olive oil and balsamic this one is a beautiful dressing that I use for my one block dressing and I'm having a tuna with it I was gonna have tuna with corn but I might just have a spring water one because I've just put corn on my salad so one of those and one of those here are my beautiful salads I made so I've just got the leaves some rocket that I had in the fridge some cucumber tomato corn a little bit of my light grated cheese I'm going to sprinkle some hemp seeds on the one that I'm eating now. I won't put on the other one until tomorrow, so I'm going to eat it. These are the pizzas that I'm going to do tonight, so I'll just chop them in half and it will make four. And I just went into my freezer and just had a look in my bit where I normally just put like roast pork, I'll slice it up and pop it in there for sandwiches. I'm not going to use all that, I'm going to take about half out. And I've also got this two, um, turkey mince, taco mince. That's absolutely beautiful when you put it on pizzas as well. So I'm going to let that thaw out. I'm going to do a couple of meat lovers sort of ones. And then a couple of just probably ham and pineapple, bacon and pineapple. I'm back from Coles. 
we didn't get too many things but I did get what was on my list and there was only one thing that I got that was on my list and that was carrots so I actually wanted carrots I just didn't have it on my list <laughs> so but um, I'll show you what we bought take that back we did buy something that wasn't on the list my daughter wanted croissants big huge box of 12 for 10 bucks so we got those uh, I got some more jets for the holiday. I got some mayo that was on special. Um, totally out of my pink Himalayan salt, so I got some of that. The carrots. <laughs> they had these little, what are they, 300 grams baked beans. They were on special for two bucks, so I got eight of those. They had the big Pringles, half price 250, so I got six of those. They had all the ladies' pads. Um, they were half price, two twenty five. Um, got some Coke. Hubby got some really nice bourbon for his birthday yesterday, so they are his for that. And I also grabbed another original with water crackers as well, because like I said, I've got a couple for barley. Well, yeah, probably one, probably only need one for barley at the moment. Calls was 78 and 92 cents, so I'll just spend all up. So I was feeling pretty pleased with myself. Um, I thought I didn't spend that much. Um, 373.62 today, but then I'd spend 132.10 yesterday. Welcome back to my channel, guys. It is hubby's birthday today. I just popped in the shop to get some stuff to make nice dinner just got him this big ass thick steak cost me 23 bucks for that one and i just got a couple of other little steaks for everyone else i got some bocconcini's marked down okay i'm gonna do a voiceover for the rest of this because my kids will play fighting in the lounge room and they're really loud so i ended up getting a 600ml cream and some ground garlic so I could do the garlic sauce for hobby's dinner. I got a jar of, or tin rather, baby carrots. I got a frozen bag of just winter mix veggies. I got a 10 pack of two minute noodles, just beef ones. I got some mushrooms. Uh, I got a couple of VIP sprays. I got some more tuna in the can. I got the mayo and corn one. I got some steakhouse chips to go with hubby's dinner. I got a 500 gram real butter. I got some nuggets and some chicken tenders. And I also bought a eight pack of seaweed. We absolutely love the stuff. So that's all for this little haul. This is my husband's birthday dinner. Did this massive steak for him. It's about half a kilo. Got mushrooms and just got some baby carrots and some chippies on the side as well. So I'd spent five hundred and five dollars and seventy two cents. And yeah, as you can imagine, didn't get much with the price of food at the moment. It's just absolutely bloody ridiculous. It actually really makes me mad. When I go to Aldi, I used to spend one hundred and sixty, and now it's just like three hundred bucks. Stupid. <sighs> but it is what it is. Um, thanks for watching. I'll see you in my next vlog, which will be me doing my mushroom arancini. If you love arancini, oh my god. I'm not a huge risotto fan by any means, but arancini is just so beautiful. These ones I make anyway. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already. And I'll see you next time. Bye.